Well, it's uh, the expectations. The organization is uh, is the best organization of hockey in Holland, and uh, you know, so the expectations, yeah, they're always high here. So I, I have high expectations on myself as well. So I, I just wanted to prove, uh, you know, that uh, I'm, uh, you know, pretty good coach, and I could uh, I could do well. And I thought, I'd, you know, achieved that uh, quite well. So the team won the championship, but I, yeah, I did have a lot of help with uh, with a lot of our staff members, and uh, you know, uh, my assistant coach Anders, and uh, and uh, all the all the players. So. Uh, uh, you know, it's what did I expect? Yeah, I expected a little bit of pressure from uh, from all the coaches that sit up in the stands a lot of times. But that's uh, I think that's normal in any club. And uh, of course, from the board, there's expectations to do well, and uh, from the players itself, is expectations to do well. So I expected uh, pretty much what uh, what I have got. So uh, as far as everything around the team goes, you know, the the, the well organized things within the uh, the staff and equipment and and so on. So I, I thought it was. Uh, it was uh, pretty good and pretty close to what uh, the expectations were. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's what did I think? Yeah, well, Mitch Mitch called me. I was uh, at that time because I was I was in Holland uh, the first uh, two weeks of August, and I went back to Czech for a week. And, uh, and then I got a call from Mitch, uh, you know, sitting at home playing with my daughter in, uh, in the garden. And then I was like, okay, uh, why is Mitch calling me? It's really, uh, really strange. And, uh, and uh, yeah, then he explained the situation. So I was like, oh, fuck, you know, it's, uh, it's not a good news. And, uh, but I, you know, uh, positive thinking because, you know, there was a lot of prognosis, uh, how long it take and maybe this, maybe that. And, uh, you know, I had my hopes that he'll be able to play, I'd say, midway through the season. And uh, we set some goals after, uh, after the checkups. Uh, and we always, you know, set, you know, set reasonable goals when we would like him to be, uh, be back and what he can do. And, uh, you know, him, him being him, you know, uh, the, the hard work effort he puts in, he, uh, he worked extremely hard to get back in the shape he's at. And, uh, and uh, I thought he had a, he had a terrific, uh, you know, end of the year and uh, was really good in the playoffs. So, uh, you know, it was... Uh, it was a big present, uh, to, you know, to get him back at a certain time, and it was also a really tough, uh, tough time for me at that time, to be honest, because we had so many guys and I had to uh, restructure the lines a little bit, and uh, there was a little bit of uh, a little bit of stress going around in the room. And uh, at the end, I thought we uh, we handled that well, and uh, we were able to uh, make our depth really, really big, and the guys bought into it, and uh, it paid off at the end.